a very warm welcome to geography class so are you enjoying your social science class i hope you are enjoying it so today we are going to start chapter 1 of our geography our environment in this chapter you will study about the environment its components and types interdependence of organisms ecosystem spheres of environment the environment and its components the word environment has come from a french word environner meaning to surround for this reason all that surround us make our environment it supports our life system environment provides us the air we breathe the water we drink the food we eat and the land where we live this can be considered as our environment it also includes plants animals and large variety of man made things which are necessary for our living thus environment has both natural and man made elements types of environment the environment thus is of following types first natural environment second man made environment natural environment the natural environment can further be divided into two groups the physical environment the biological environment the physical environment includes all living things like land water and air the biological environment includes all living things like plant and animals human being is the most important component of the biological environment and he satisfies all his basic needs from both parts of the environment the natural environment that is the physical and the biological are largely interdependent and cannot be separated any major change in the physical environment is bound to bring a change in the accompanying biological environment the change may be fast or slow for example the formation of soil cannot be visualized through our senses on the other hand some changes are very sudden like a change brought by earthquake or volcano interdependence of organisms organism or the living things on the earth are of three types producers consumers and decomposers green plants are found are food producers as they make their food themselves herbivores and carnivores are consumers as they are dependent on plants and animals respectively and then decomposers such as bacteria break down the dead plant and animals and produce energy for consumers energy is supplied from one organism to another making a food chain and many food chains form a food web if any chain or web is disturbed all the organisms will be badly affected this can be our food chain producer consumer consumer decomposer ecosystem all types of things that are part of our environment make together an ecosystem that support our life any change in our ecosystem affects our life and disturbs it for example if trees are cut it will reduce rains on the earth and plants will die as a result human beings and animals will have to face food shortage many plants and animal species are wiped out due to our affected ecosystem this is the image of our ecosystem spheres of our environment there are four spheres of natural environment first lithosphere second atmosphere third hydrosphere fourth biosphere this is the image of spheres of environment lithosphere lithosphere is made up of silica and magnesium and silica aluminum it is also called as sima plus cl is equals to lithosphere lithosphere is the sphere of rock it is about 100 km thick the uppermost part of the lithosphere is made from silica and aluminum called cl below it the rocks are made of silica and magnesium and are called sima found below the ocean basins thus lithosphere is that part of the earth which provides us land over which we live lithosphere is the source of all the mineral wealth and provides soil for the plants atmosphere the atmosphere is the sphere of air the atmosphere is composed of a mixture of gases which forms an envelope around the earth it is a gaseous envelope extending about 1600 km above the earth surface this is the image of atmosphere and its layers now let's come to hydrosphere hydrosphere is the sphere of water it is present in oceans rivers lakes and other water bodies on the earth surface this can be an image for hydrosphere biosphere biosphere means the sphere of life biosphere is the narrow zone of contact between all the three spheres of environment where all kinds of life exist 
most of the living organisms like plant, animals and human microbes are present in the biosphere. This is the image of biosphere. We should live in harmony with, with our surroundings because this will help the earth to sustain all forms of life on it. The earth faces diversity in land, soil, plants and animals. This process of diversification has occurred largely over long period of time resulting in the emergence of new species of plants and animals. These changes are necessary for life. Sustenance of all living things are described together as biodiversity. To conserve this biodiversity, the Government of India has passed the Wildlife Protection Act 1972 under which 66 national parks and 36 wildlife sanctuaries have been established in different parts of India. Human Environment Human environment is the surrounding made by the man-made things such as houses, cars, table, chair, sofa, train, bus, aeroplane, ship, etc. These are the things made by the man for their comfort. The advancement of science and technology has made the man able to exploit the things from natural environment fast and disrupting the ecosystem resulting into environment degradation. Summing up, environment includes all the things that surround us. Natural environment is Made is both physical soil, air, water and biological environment such as plants, animals and humans. Organisms are interdependent on each other. Lithosphere, atmosphere, hydrosphere and biosphere are the spheres of environment. The things present in environment make together an ecosystem that supports our life. Thank you class. Let's meet in the next chapter.